Welcome back to NRM 638, Python Scripting for ArcGIS Applications. Spring Semester 2015. This is an e-learning class at the University of Alaska Fairbanks. From last time, we have a Python script toolbox, and we have a tool. And what we want to do is interact between these two parameters. So our second parameter is disabled. We'd like is once we make a selection, projected, enable this parameter, and allow the user to pick among several projected coordinate systems. Or if the user picks geographic, enable this parameter and allow the user to pick from several geographic coordinate systems. So what we'll do is we'll edit our Python toolbox. So right mouse click, edit. And here's our parameters are defined as a class. So we define parameter 0 and parameter 1. So now what we're going to do is go to the class update parameters. In update parameters, modify the values and properties of parameters before internal validation is performed, and also whenever a parameter has been changed. So in this case, our parameter will be changed projected or geographic will be the change. So this class has an input of parameters, which is a list of our parameters. So then what we would do is say, okay, if that first parameter in our list is equal to some value, then we'll execute. And that value will be if it's projected. So I can copy this, paste. So if parameter 0 is projected, then we'll give the user choices. So we'll give the user a list, and the choice will be UTN Zone 6 or Alaska Albers. And we need to make sure our parameter is set so it's a value list filter type. So we set parameter 1, filter type is value list. And then if the user picks projected, then we want to enable this. So then we would set parameters dot enabled equals true. And otherwise, if the user picks the choice geographic, then we'll give the user a list of geographic coordinate systems. So GCS NAD83 or GCS WGS84. And then once again, enable that parameter is true, so the user has access to it. So we'll put that before we give the user our choice. OK, so then we'll save and then check for any syntax errors. So we have one indentation error. And in this case, my else if does not line up with my if. So then we'll save and check the module. So this time it works. But first I forgot to put the property, so dot value. So if our parameter dot value is projected, then the user should have these choices. And otherwise, if the parameter dot value is geographic, then the user should see these choices. So then we'll save and test drive it. So initially, our coordinate system is disabled until we make a choice. So if we choose projected, then we get a drop-down menu of choices. So UTM Zone 6 or Alaska Albers. And if we choose geographic, then we get a different list of choices. So NAD83 or WGS84. Okay, so that's the last of the video sessions for this week. So if you go to the Blackboard website, the assignment this week is one Python toolbox. And what you'll do is create that Python toolbox and then email me your PYT file.